All right, my friends, we are live, rocking and rolling here. Hello, welcome to day 10 of our challenge. Wowzers, guys, two weeks straight on, Monday through Friday. Can we just like applause ourselves for a little bit? Thank you so much for those that are joining consistently and every day and leaving a like on my videos. I appreciate you guys so much. I really, truly mean it. For those of you who might just be clicking on my page for the first time, hi there, my name is Grecia and I am currently doing a 30 day challenge for the month of October, a total body reset. And this whole week guys, we have been using the band, the resistant band. So today I thought happy Friday vibes, more calm, more just flowing, a little bit more of a stretch flow today. So welcome we will not be needing any equipment today just your beautiful self and body i was drinking a kombucha right now for this nice heat it is midday and my son is taking a nap and i am ready for you guys so cheers to that hmm. and uh, let's go ahead and begin the vibe is very calm right now my friend so i hope you feel that with this flow so let's start like we always do with some deep inhales just breathing through our nose out through our mouth <sighs> cleansing that air let's take two more of those take a deep inhale fill up all the way to the crown of your head and just when you think you can't take another breath, go ahead and take one more sip of air. And exhale through your mouth. Let it all go. Two more. Inhale. Up your spine, opening up that chest, and exhale. Finding yourself on your mat. Last one. Let's make it our deepest. Inhale. Hold it. And exhale. So, so good, my friends. All right. Let's continue with this breathing in through our nose, out through our mouth. And just wanted you to find yourself on your mat, calming yourself, grounding yourself. And I'd like for you to start thinking of an intention. What brought you here today and what's going to keep you here today? Every day is different. Every day our bodies feels different. How are you feeling today? What does your body need today? Whatever that may be, let's go ahead and inhale your hands up into the sky. And exhale, pray your hands. All right, my friends, find yourself in a quad quadruped position. So we're going to stack our hips over our knees and our shoulders over our wrists. And then we're just going to invite some organic movement. Maybe you drop that belly, open up through your chest. And then you exhale, round out that back, tuck your tailbone in, and exhale, breathe in, inhale, drop your belly, look up, broaden through your shoulders, away from your ears. And then exhale, round out your spine. So good. Maybe you tuck that chin to your chest. Really try to look towards the between your knees. And then back into that inhale. Exhale. All right, my friends, find your neutral position here, hip bones facing your mat. Maybe you add some hip circles here. Hip circles, maybe you do a figure eight. Maybe you just round out your hips or make them go side to side. 
And then when you're ready, you're just going to find stillness here. And you're going to take a deep inhale. Then on your exhale, you're going to extend that left leg back, right hand forward. Creating this opposition stretch here. We're going to keep that nice left elbow nice bend, not locking it out. And we're going to pretend like someone's pulling us from each side, keeping our navel to our spine. So good. Maybe you add a little hip, um, a little foot roll and hand circle, loosening up. And then we're going to take a deep inhale, tap down. Exhale, lift. Inhale, exhale, lift. Four, eight, seven, six more. Five. Just keeping your breath. Three. Two and one. Arch all the way up. Reach for that back foot with your hand and take that nice stretch here. Open up your heart a little bit deeper and release. Come straight into the other side. Left hand out, right foot out. Stretching like someone's pulling you apart. And then and lift. Go to your spine here, keeping that long spine. We got four more. Three, two, and one. Reach for that foot behind you. Stretch it out. Kick and lift. Opening up through that heart center and release so good my friends tuck those toes behind you and find yourself in a downward dog take a deep inhale exhale through your mouth widen those shoulders away from your ears fingertips are wide and sp spread out and then when you're ready, we're going to just go ahead and pedal out those feet here, finding yourself loosening through the spine. Let's do eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three more. And one. Lift those heels, send them over to the right. Find that nice side stretch and inhale, send them to your left. Ooh, feeling so good here. All right, find your middle, my friends. This time, we're going to inhale that right leg up, tap it down. Right leg up and tap it down here. We're just warming up. Four, five more. Four. Three, two, and one. Opening up that hip. Send that heel to your back. Opening up. And release. Bring that right leg down. Left leg up. We got eight, seven, six. Starting to feel warmed up on the upper body as well. Four more. Three, two, and one. Opening up your hip. Send that foot back. And release. So good, my friends. Pedal out your feet. Then inhale that right leg up. Exhale. You're going to bring that knee to your chest. Really round out your spine. Like you want to tuck that chin to your chest. And bring it up. Exhale, tuck in. Inhale up. Exhale, knee in. Four, eight. Seven. Six. Five. Really warming up through the core. Four more. Three. Two. And we're going to hold one. Hold it here for three, two, 
one send that right leg back inhale that left leg up exhale bring it in inhale back exhale bring it in whoops six more five using our breath four three two more feeling that heat and hold one bring it in a little bit higher pike up for three two and one Whew. bring those legs down drop your knees bring yourself to a child pose inhale through your nose out through your mouth Find that nice stretch. Release through your hands. So good, my friends. And exhale. Come on up. You're going to find yourself in a downward dog one last time. Well, not the last time, but for right now. You're going to inhale that right leg up. Exhale. You're going to swing it through all the way between your two hands. So good. We're going to keep those heel, that back heel lifted. You're going to inhale. Bring your hands all the way up. Crescent lunge here. So good, my friends. You're going to inhale your hands up. Straighten out that front leg. Exhale. Bend your knee. Swing those hands behind you. Inhale. Straighten out. Exhale. Bend the knee. Send your hands behind you. Keeping that back heel lifted at all times. Five more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale up, exhale back, two more, last one, inhale up, exhale, bend, so good my friends, this time you're going to bring both hands down to your mat, you're going to turn to the right side, opening up with your right hand up to the sky, following your gaze with your eyes to your fingers finding that nice twist here for a reverse side angle and then exhale bring your hands inside your foot right foot bring that left heel down inhale bring your left hand up following it with your gaze finding that nice twist of your side body here maybe you extend your hand forward Feeling that line, stretch, and exhale. You're going to straighten out that foot, right foot, and you're going to bring yourself down the middle of the mat. Your feet are out wide, knees are pointing towards your toes, and all we're going to do is we're going to bend those knees. Inhale, hands up. Bend your knees, squat. Inhale, up. So you're Feet are about a 10 and 2 position here, just out wide and finding some nice movement here. Inhaling up, exhaling down. Inhaling hands up and down. Four more. Three. Two. And one. So good, my friends. You're going to turn this time to the left lift off of those heels and we're going to do the same thing again we're going to bend our knee bring those hands behind us inhale bring those hands up and exhale bend that left knee inhale straighten out exhale bend so nothing else is moving just that front leg and that nice movement of your back and arms we got four more three two and one release bring your hands down both of them turn to your left side this time bring your left hand up Turn your gaze towards the sky, feeling that nice twist on our leg, on our spine, side glute. 
and exhale down bring both hands inside your foot twist that back heel down inhale right hand up find your nice stretch here working all of our inner thighs as well maybe you find an extension here with your hand over your ear one more deep breath in and on your exhale you're going to bring your hands down straighten out your feet bring your hands down to your middle of your mat and again we're going to squat down inhale up squat down inhale up so good just flushing it out here inhale exhale up inhale exhale four more three so good my friends two and one come on up star pose you're gonna turn back to your right side bring your hands down find yourself in a plank position here so good my friends now this time we're gonna take that left right knee to right elbow push back left knee left elbow push back four eight seven six five find a nice bend in those elbows maybe wrap them towards the back of your body four more three two and one this time we're going to bring your knee to your opposite elbow push back opposite elbow push back left to right left to le right to left for eight seven six staying strong on the upper body four more three two and one downward dog Whew, take a deep inhale in through your nose, out through your mouth. <sighs> so good, my friends. All right. This time, we're all we're going to do is we're going to bend those elbows and push up. Bend elbows down and push up away in our downward dog position. So let's do eight. Elbows are facing each other. We're just finding a little micro bend for six more. Three, you're looking in between your hands here, keeping that long spine. Four, three, navel to your spine. Two more, we got this. And one, so good. Push back, downward dog. In through your nose, out through your mouth. And come on down to your knees. All right, my friends. We are going to bring, whoops, we are going to bring ourselves into um, a kneeling position here. Right knee is going to come up. Left knee is just going to go behind you. So let's do this. Come to the side of your, so your right is facing the front of your mat parallel and you're bringing that left knee behind you maybe your heel is aligned with your bum here we're going to take a deep inhale and exhale find yourself in a nice mermaid stretch here so we're going to inhale that right hand up over your left so good and exhale bring it down you're going to bring your forearm all the way down to the mat you're going to inhale that left hand up exhale you're going to weave it through your body inhale back up exhale weave through inhale back up four eight seven feeling that nice twist on our obliques Finding extension through our chest. Five more. 
reaching back and up we got three more my friends feeling this nice stretch here two and one my necklace <laughs> all right my friends this time we're gonna extend that leg that top leg out to the side of us we're gonna inhale exhale bring that knee in and lift off of our obliques here and once we do that we're gonna bring our right knee in towards our elbow and extend it out just finding a little crunch here but also some extension for eight seven Six, five, four, three more, two, and one. All right, stack those knees right in front of you. We're going to come all the way down to the mat. So good, guys. All right, we're going to stack those shins parallel to the front of your mat. We're going to bring that bottom arm to the back of your head stacking your shoulders then you're going to take a deep inhale exhale you're going to turn just you're going to follow your gaze towards the back of your elbow and then turn back finding more of a twist here opening up through our heart our pelvic muscles are so stable they are not moving we're giving that waist transverse muscles a little twist here. Four more. Three. On that last one, we're going to extend that leg out to the side of us. And one. This time, my friends, we're going to bring ourselves back forward. Extend your leg out to the back. And once you start twisting forward, you're going to bring your knee to the front kick and bring it back down so then you close again so we're doing a little bicycle leg here as we twist so we're extending closing when we open up we bring our leg up once we're closing through the front we bring it back so good four more three two and one so good my friends drop that knee down All right we're taking a lift ourselves to the front of the mat one last time then we're gonna come up into a downward dog. And then exhale, we're gonna bring that left knee forward. So we're gonna find our other side mermaid. So left knee forward, I'm gonna do it to the front of your mat. Right knee back, right heel back. All right, so good guys. Find that nice side stretch here. Bring that left hand over to your left. Feeling this nice stretch. So we're in like in a zigzag position here. And then we're gonna bring that left forearm down to the ground. Your heel, your left shin is parallel to the front of your mat. You're gonna inhale your right hand up. Exhale, weave it through. Inhale up, exhale through. Whoops, gonna move my mic here. Four, six more. Find that nice rotation here, guys. Try to get a little bit deeper. We're not using our bottom um, body here, so we can really focus on weaving that hand through and reaching behind us, finding a nice stretch, opening up our shoulders with that twist as well. You feel it down your back. We got two more. Inhale. 
exhale and last one so good my friends now we bring that left knee in finding yourself in a kneeling position extend that right leg out and all we're doing is we're going to drop those hips bring your knee to your elbow and extend in and out again if that's too much for you maybe you just want to stay down you don't want to add that hip no big deal add what you can today we're taking it easy four more three two and one release come on down stack those hips bring your shins parallel to the front come all the way down to your mat bottom hand you're cradling your head then you're bringing your hands behind your back inhale exhale opening up those elbows following with your gaze inhale exhale find that twist so good loosening up our spine being easy on it find your happy medium here let's do three more four more three two and one so good guys now once we bring that elbow out to the front we're going to extend that leg out as we inhale we're going to bring that knee e when we exhale and open up to the side we're going to kick our leg forward kick it back just finding yourself doing this bicycle motion with your leg four more whoops three two and one so good my friends keep that out and bring it back towards you all right my friends we're gonna lift ourselves up one last time and find yourself in a downward dog just flushing it all out all right feeling good let's bring that right knee down then your left pedaling out your feet so good guys and then when you're ready, you're going to walk your feet forward and then finding yourself in a seated position facing forward. So good. All right. We are going to add a little bit of core here just so we can finish out nice and strong. More of a stretch than anything. All right, my friends, you're going to bring your hands out in front of you. Inhale, pop that chest forward exhale you're gonna curve out your spine make yourself a little c curve inhale come on up exhale reach curve out inhale up inhale up exhale curve out loosening up that spine four more three two and one lift that right leg up tabletop then your left so good guys now from here we're going to curve out that spine just a tiny bit and we're going to tap that toes left right toes down then left right and left maybe you add a little bit of a roll back here as we are tapping down maybe you just tap your feet down don't add that roll back totally how you feel today maybe you twist to your back as you twist opposite leg maybe you add an extension maybe you don't maybe you're just staying tapping your toes down totally up to you here we can stay here we can add that dip 
And then we can also add that extension of your leg. Four more, guys. I know, this is a lot of twisting, but we got this. Two. And one, so good. This time, my friends, you're gonna bring that right knee in, hug it in, let a right hand out to the side of your ankle, left hand inside. You're gonna stretch that left leg out and find yourself scooping all the way down. You're not coming just quite yet down to your back, but keeping this nice curve here, single leg stretches, pull, pull, and switch, pull, pull, and switch four eight seven six five four three two more my friends and one release come all the way down extend that left leg out reach that right leg forward and straight up we're going to do some nice circles here is going clockwise out each time you go around you want to widen your range giving yourself some nice hip circles all the way up inhale exhale as you come up inhale exhale up inhale exhale up two more and last one make it your deepest all right, now we're gonna reverse those circles. Let's start out small again. Nice and controlled. Nice and controlled as you widen up. A little bit bigger, four more. Inhale, exhale, up. Three more. Two. And one, so good guys. Hug that knee in and send it over to your left side, opening up towards your right. Whew, maybe you keep a cactus arm, maybe you extend. So good, guys. We're almost done, I promise. Just take this time to thank your body for all it does for us. And exhale, extend that right leg out, bring that left leg up, starting with those circles. So we're going to bring our hands down to the side again, and we're going to start with some clockwise circles, nice and small. Inhaling, exhaling every time we want to use that exhale to bring it up. Getting deeper. Four more. Notice how each side might feel a little bit different. Mine for sure has a less of a range. Last one. And come on up. So good. Now let's reverse those cir hip circles. So good. Nothing else is moving. Just that leg. We're keeping our pelvic muscles nice and strong. All right, my friends. Four more. Three. Two, and one, so good. Send that left leg over to your right, look to your left. Find your nice twist here. We have definitely twisted our backs today. I hope that you're feeling nice and loose. We just hold so much tension all over our body. Sometimes it feels good to just take it easy. Breathe into our muscles and exhale. Bring that leg in. Maybe you hug your knees in back and forth. Start rocking yourself like a little ball here. Up and down and up and down. So good, guys. And when you're ready, we're going to extend those legs out and those hands up above you. We're gonna finish super strong today, my friends, with some nice teasers. So we're gonna inhale our hands up above us. And on our exhale, we're gonna tuck our chin to our chest and we're gonna lift our hands and feet towards each other, finding yourself in this like inversion 
pike position. Inhale, come on down. Exhale. Using our breath to pike up. You can do it. Inhale, down. Exhale. Pike up. Let's do four more. Three. Two. And one. Stay up here, my friend. Hold it for me. Hold it. Stay strong. Four, ten. Nine, eight. Tuck those ribs in. Three, five, four. I'm shaking. Three, two, one. Release. Bring yourselves down. Go ahead and find yourself in a quadruple position. Whoops, I am everywhere. In the quadruple position, give yourself some nice rolls here. Maybe a cat cow. And then when you're ready, we're just going to bring ourselves into a kneeling position. We're going to open up our hearts into a little camel toe. So all I want you to do is bring those shoulders back. You're going to put your place your hands right below, um, like you're above your tailbone between that nice little muscle there. You're just gonna lean back, opening up your chest here. If that feels good to you, maybe you let your head go. Just kind of opening up. If you think you could go a little bit deeper without straining your back, you can go ahead and grab those heels. And exhale, come on up, child's pose. That is a hard, that is totally a heart opener. Some emotions might come up when you do that. Just notice how you feel and let them go. They come and go always. Find that nice shell stretch by um, really engaging your core, lifting through your belly, not letting it drop to your thighs, and really extending those fingertips forward. Engage through your core and release so good my friends all right come to that middle of your mat we're going to do a little frog stretch here so we're going to bring our knees wider than our hips and our feet wider than our knees and then you're going to come down to your forearms and let those hips fall right in between so good little hip opener here Letting it all go. Feel all the tension. And release anything that doesn't serve you. Just let it all go. And release. Find yourself. Come back the way you came in. Tuck those till, uh, feet in. Then your knees. And then find yourself in a forward seated position. All right, my friends, we're going to do another nice little mermaid stretch here. Maybe you cross your feet. Maybe you're kneeling position. We're just going to open up that right hand, bring it over to our left. Maybe you bring your left elbow down. Maybe you stay up, whatever feels right for you. Maybe you look up towards that right shoulder and then bring it down to the side. Look down, feel that nice stretch. And walk it over to the other side. Sitting those sit bones down. Feeling that nice tug and pull of our muscles here. And look down as you stretch out those side. These long lat muscles here. And all the way down. Roll yourself up, my friends. Maybe you bring your hands behind you. Come on forward. Open up your chest. Then bring them forward. You interlace your fingers in front of you. And exhale. Come on up. Exhale. Release. So good, my friends. Give yourself some shoulder rolls. We are all done, guys. All done. 40 minutes of just yummy stretching let's go ahead and take one last deep inhale 
bring our hands up into the sky and exhale pray your hands thank you for showing up with me today on our mats my friends may this beautiful connection with our breath connect us to the highest frequency there is to live on this plane this dimension this universe May all these beautiful things that happen to us be a reminder of that the small miracles always happen for us, not to us. And have a wonderful weekend, guys. Thank you for accomplishing day 10 of our challenge, and I will see you guys Monday. Bye. Whew.